this is a game. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry, 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 hurry. Ah. Look at what I found right now. When it, uh, one of the perks of being a certified video game junkie is that you actually get to do a lot of cool things with video games. One of these, one of the cool things that I, I have gotten the the uh, the the luck to do is be a part of these betas. This is a beta. And this game is loadout. Now, on the the surface, it looks like it's a Team Fortress, like, uh, wannabe Team Fortress 2. I'm going to tell you that it's a lot better than Team Fortress. I'm just going to go out here and, th and throw that out there. Uh, you probably don't feel the same way. I know Team Fortress is a very popular game and that a lot of people play Team Fortress. But I think this game right here has pretty a, a pretty good chance of... Of really giving Team Fortress, uh, Team Fortress, Team Fortress, and when I say Team Fortress, I mean Team Fortress 2, the the latest installment of Team Fortress, whatever it is, right? Um, I think that it has a really good chance of actually giving Team Fortress some competition, man. Seriously, and the first couple times I played this game, I was like, "This is stupid. This is dumb. What is this?" Then. I started getting into matches that were like really good matches and really competitive and I was like, oh my god, this is so much better than Team Fortress. And uh, I will say that I've had more fun playing this game than I have Team Fortress. But I, I really haven't played Team Fortress that much, okay? So I, I'm, I'm going to say it before you even get this chance to say it, before you dislike this video, I'm going to say it first, okay? I, I'm, I'm really not in a position to speak of, of Team Fortress as a whole because I haven't played it that much. So, I've already beat you to the punch. Because I know somebody's going to be like, you didn't mean play Team Fortress that much, dude. You said it yourself. You got to play it, dude. And I know, I need to play it. Maybe Team Fortress 2 blows this out of the water. I just haven't played it. Especially not now that I have the, the COD 4 with, with all the mods in it. You know, so... From my limited experience between both of these games, and I literally have played these games about the same amount of time. I've had more fun playing this game than I have Team Fortress 2. So as of right now, as of February 4th, 2013, I'm saying that this game is better than Team Fortress 2. If you don't like it, please. I mean, I don't know what you're going to do. I, can, I, 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 really, I really don't know what to tell you. But anyway... Uh, what was I saying? The, the thing about this game that's really cool is that you can, like, pick your gun and, um, not pick your gun. You can create guns from scratch. And I really don't, I really haven't worked with, actually, yeah, I spent, like, a, I spent a straight hour today trying to fix up the best looking gun. Alright? And what I came up with was a gun that was really powerful, but the reload was kind of slow because it was rockets and then... You know, it's just things like that. Like, you can have flame, slug, electricity, or you can have... It's, it's a, a lot of things. I will say this. It does copy off of Team Fortress 2 a lot. I will say that with the customization in it. Because I know that in Team Fortress 2, you can run around with a gun that shoots out health. And I know in this game, Loadout, you can do the same thing. And I think it's like one is health and another one is like something that will boost up your your stats or like your players, st your teammates stats. It's like that. So while this game comes off as like some bootleg Team Fortress 2, I don't know exactly how they plan on setting themselves apart from Team Fortress 2. Uh, so uh, I really just don't, you know, I don't really know that much about Team Fortress 2 to be honest with you I don't I made this video so I can show off this game because I think it's awesome I think it's awesome you know and uh, I'm gonna continue to play this this is just a beta that's why the level looks like crap I'm I, that's my guess because I was running around and I was like man this level looks like shit and then I, I played on another level and it looked exactly like this so my guess is because it's a beta um, the, the levels just on texture. They give you the basics so you can just play the game and get a uh, get a feel for the, how the engine play, the, how the game engine plays. You know, get the bugs out, which is good. Like I said, I'm a fan of betas, not because I like playing uh, games early. It's because it actually gives players a real chance to play a game and give the developers honest feedback on what they need to fix before the game gets released. I've always said that. I wish uh, stupid Infinity Ward and Treyarch would do this, but alas, they have not.
because they don't care about what the consumer thinks honestly anyway uh if you are if you i don't even know how to set up i i got sent this key for the beta and you get it through steam i don't know if you can do that i don't i don't know whether you can sign up from the website but if you just go to google and search loadout game the website will pop up and you can go through the the whole website and see if you can sign up if you can uh, get on it and play around and see whether you feel the same way i do which is kind of you know whatever anyway i'm not having it in the game caviar studio and i'm out this has been a game caviar production like this video and subscribe for more